horses are on the track for the fourth race at the Illinois State Fair and elimination of the Illinois State Fair Colt Stakes for two-year-old pacing fillies. Number one, Can Commute, owned by James Jask of Lamont, trained by Nelson Willis. Tony Morgan is in the bike. Number two, Loyal Opposition, owned by Bob Waxman of Ancaster, Ontario, trained by Irvin Miller. Andy Miller is up. Number three, Please Me Sleazy, owned by Marty Engel of Buffalo Grove, trained by Katrina Rucker. Mike Osting will drive. Number four, Finance the Farm, owned by Don Laufenberg of Highland, Wisconsin, trained by Lloyd Dalton, Dale Heitman, the driver. Number five, Shirley Graham is scratched. The six major sunset is owned by Shirley and Arthur Levin of Hoffman Estates, trained and driven by Homer Hochstetler. And number seven, Odds On Lori, owned by Robin Schatz, Odds On Racing of Oaklawn, trained by Robin Schatt, Dave McGee, is in the bike. Post time in five minutes. And again, the top three will come back for next week's $55,000 final and one fourth place finisher to be drawn by lot. Here they come. They're off and pacing. Major Sunset goes for the early lead. Can Commute gets away second on the inside, followed by Loyal Opposition, who comes out racing in third at the entry to the first turn. Major Sunset gets to the front, gets over toward the rail, leading it by three lengths now as they race toward the quarter-mile mark. Can Commute goes second by two. Loyal Opposition races in third by two lengths and is followed by Please Me Sleazy in fourth. Two more lengths to finance the farm, another two to odds on Lori, who's 11 lengths off the leader. 28 seconds for the opening quarter, headed onto the back stretch. They're being led by Major Sunset by two lengths. Major Sunset is chased by Can Commute. Loyal Opposition is waiting patiently in third, five lengths off the lead. Then Please Me Sleazy, finance the farm, and odds on Lori is last. They're all single file as they move toward the half. Major Sunset is on top by a length and a half. Can Commute goes second. Two more lengths to Loyal Opposition. The half, 56 and two-fifths seconds. Please Me Sleazy is racing fourth against the rail. Another two lengths to Finance the Farm. And Odds on Lori is still last, but right there. Finance the Farm is moving from the number five position. And here comes Loyal Opposition off the rail from third. Approaching the three quarters, Major Sunset leads it by a length. The American National winner, Loyal Opposition, begins to move alongside and move on by. Loyal Opposition, followed by Can Commute, who goes to second. Three quarters, 125 and four. Major Sunset is dropping back third. Finance the Farm is fourth. Please Me Sleazy needs room. Odds on Lori is last. Eighth pole for Loyal Opposition, opening up on a four-length lead. And Can Commute is racing in second. Can Commute tries to cut into the margin, but Loyal Opposition has her by two. Can Commute is trying. Finance the Farm is third. No catching. Loyal Opposition. Loyal Opposition wins it by two lengths. Can Commute was second. Finance the Farm third. Odds on Lori was fourth. One, 52, and four. prevails. Irvin Miller trains his third winner of the day. Andy Miller, the winning driver, loyal opposition. 152 and 4. This Cole Muffler filly is owned by Ancaster, Ontario investment broker Bob Waxman, bred by Cottonwood Farm of Big Rock, Illinois, which will offer a full brother to this filly at their upcoming sale on Sunday. September the 8th at the farm in Big Rock. Come on up here, Andy Miller. We're going to grab a quick word with Andy. Now we've been seeing these guys from Michigan and Wisconsin who now race in Illinois. The Illinois State Fair promotes the best that Illinois has to offer, and this would be one of them. This gentleman grew up in central Illinois in Arthur. Andy, you are rapidly moving up that list of winningest drivers in State Fair history. You have a lot of fun here, don't you? I love it here. It's uh, like coming back home, and it's a lot of fun. We talked to you and I back in the barn area. Your first State Fair champion was King's Hope in the aged horse and gelding trot over a dozen years ago. Do you still remember that day? Absolutely. That was uh, my own horse and one of my favorites, so it was a big thrill that day. 
You people from Illinois, are you proud of your Illinois and Andy Miller? How about a hand for Andy? He's our winning driver. Congratulations.